I'm struggling to breathe. I'm drowning when I can't have you. So tell me we can be anything we wanted to. Show me that you need it. Come a little closer. Long story short, I first met Nigel when I was 17, and I won a competition to play at, to play at Manchester Arena. And uh, he was he was backstage, and I knew of Nigel obviously, and he's. He's, he's quite a known face, particularly in and around Manchester. So I just went up to him and I was like, will you manage me? And he sat down with me and he said, but you're so young. Um, and being in this industry, if you were to break this young, it's very tough because you're traveling and all this. And you'd be on your own, ultimately, was what he was saying to me. And he said, look, would you ever, would you do anything with, with any other, other people? Like, would you be in a band? And, he, and I was just like, yeah, of course I would. I'll, I'll try anything, I'm up for anything. Um, and he said, right, I'll tell you what then, well, you go away and you go on YouTube and Facebook and you go and find people that you think you can work with and bring them in to me and we'll see if we can get a project going. So I literally went home and that's all I did for like months, literally months. And I was stalking people online, I was on YouTube, I was ringing up with mates as they were stacking shelves and I'll be like, can you sing? Do you want to be in a band? But uh, no, literally that's how I did it. And then there was a couple of different lineups and we were trying different things and then they didn't work. So all in all, it was, Took about a year to find <clears throat> kind of like the, the lineup of well, just the band that felt right, really. So. Yeah, it was yeah. important to like you know you get to know the people you're gonna spend the next five six years with, you know the people you're gonna create music with. So you gotta get along and you gotta have similar interests and things like that. So it was a lengthy process, but mm. we're happy. Yeah. See if you can we're stand happy. each other. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> But as a whole, Nigel, as a manager, is just, he's like everything you'd look for in a manager. Like he always says to us, this is your band, this is your career, and he sort of like guides us and he always, he really respects our opinion as, as, as artists and like. He's not only like a, a manager to the band, but like he'll always make sure yeah. that we're all right, you know, anything's going on in our lives or what, literally anything. And like, he always says to us, you can ring me 24 seven, like, you know. And yeah. So I, we feel really lucky that we have someone who's genuinely, we feel like he's really got our, got our back, you know, no matter what happens. And, He's um yeah he's, he's just just, just a nice guy, guy. Like, yeah. Yeah.